All right, as promised, I'm sharing with you guys all of my workouts from this current training split today with a full chest, shoulders, and triceps push day. Starting with a flat machine chest press. Obviously, if your gym doesn't have one of these, then regular old dumbbells will work just fine, but the machine does create a little bit more stability, which will allow your chest to produce slightly more force. Next up is an incline press, either seated or lying, as long as your arm path is in the direction of your upper chest fibers. The machine at my gym, unfortunately, did not converge, which is something I place a high importance on, so I went over to the lying variant and then realized I was actually on the flat press and not the incline one. So if you're gonna use this, obviously do make sure that you are using the correct machine and your gym actually does have it. Again, the arm path should be upwards in relation to your torso to bias your upper chest and not perpendicular, which will bias the middle chest, making this completely redundant since we already did a flat press. After that, I did a decline press for the lower chest, this time making sure that my arm path was downwards. And then for a curveball, I threw in some seated shoulder press, which I actually haven't done in nearly six months. I mean, this Ibex machine was practically begging for me to use it and you know, might as well. But after after that, I did a super set of cable Y raises into behind the back raises for some lateral delts, and then I finished off with a few sets of cable crossbody pushdowns for the triceps, followed by a couple sets of katana extensions. Also, my protein just dropped a new cola flavored clear whey. Honestly, it tastes surprisingly similar to actual soda. Maybe that's just because I haven't drank soda in half a decade, but still, if you do enjoy soda, then I recommend giving this a try. As always, code MAXE for an extra 35% off, and I hope you do enjoy.